Samuel Langhorne Clemens, more well known by his pen name Mark Twain, was one of the most influential writers of his time. He was also known as an entrepreneur, publisher, and lecturer, but was most famous for his classic American novel. Twain was born on November 30, 1835, in a small town in Missouri to parents John Marshall and Jane Lampton Clemens. He was the sixth child of the Clemens, along with four brothers, one which died at birth, and two sisters. When Twain was four, the Clemens moved 35 miles away to a busier, larger town called Hannibal. Twain had many struggles in his life, beginning at an early age. First, he was kept inside up to age nine due to poor health. Then, at age 12, he lost his father to pneumonia. Twain didn't have much formal education. He attended a private school in Hannibal once he regained his health up until the age of 12. However, when Twain's father died, he had to leave school to earn money for the family. First, he took an apprenticeship at his brother Orion's newspaper, where he learned to love writing. Then he took a number of small jobs, including a printer's devil, a typesetter, and an editorial assistant. These jobs took him to a number of major cities, but he eventually returned to working for his brother's paper. Mark married his wife Olivia Langdon in 1870. Mark and Olivia gave birth to four children, one that died in infancy and two that died in their 20s. Their daughter Clara lived to be 88 years old and gave Mark a grandchild named Nina. His writing began to gain fame with the publishment of his short story, The Celebrated Jumping Frog of Calvarez County, in New York Saturday Press in 1865. Twain's first book, The Innocents Abroad, was published in 1869. Twain was quickly becoming the country's most outstanding realist writer. His writing was famous for using dialect and common speech, portraying life as it was, not romanticizing, and depicting personal experiences. Two of Twain's most famous novels were The Adventures of Tom Sawyer and The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn, which are still as widely read as they were in the 1800s. Considering Mark Twain's huge influence on American literature, he did not receive many awards in his lifetime. Some awards he did receive were an honorary Master of Arts degree from Yale and an honorary Doctor of Letters degree from both Yale and Oxford. He was known as the father of American literature and also named the greatest American humorist of his age. He also has many famous quotes which have been used in presidential speeches. He has many prizes named after him, and aside from all his literary accomplishments, he also has several inventions, including a self-sticking scrapbook, a trivia game about history, and a garment mechanism improving suspenders. Mark Twain died on April 21, 1910 in Reading, Connecticut. Before his death, he moved to Bermuda for warmer weather, and when he thought he was feeling better, he moved back to his hometown. However, after a few days, he had a heart attack in his sleep and died. Twain's last words were to his daughter Clara, goodbye if we meet, but he never got to finish his last sentence. His gravesite is in Elmira, New York, and you can now go visit it. Although there are many fun facts about the author, one in particular that sticks out is about how he adopted his pseudonym Mark Twain. While working as a rover pilot's apprentice, he decided to use the term which means safe to navigate. Another interesting fact about Twain is that he was born shortly after Halley's Comet arrived and predicted he would go out with it as well, which he did, dying one day after Halley's Comet made its closest past. <laughs> <laughs>